So he's there and he sees an apple fall to the earth. Didn't hit him in the head. That, that's just tail. And in the sky is the moon. Okay. So he thinks to himself, is there some way to connect the falling apple with the orbiting moon? Hmm. Is there some single understanding that renders these two things that I'm looking at the same? Most people would look at it and say, well, there's something different going on in the moon than for the apple because the apple landed on Earth on the ground. Right. And the, and the moon, moon is not falling. To, uh, it stays up. Okay. So clearly it's different. But we're talking about Isaac Newton. And so he said, let's do an experiment, a thought experiment. Let's go to a mountaintop and take the apple and just sort of drop it. Okay. It'll fall to the, ground, to the earth the way it does in his backyard. But now let's sort of fire it from a cannon at ever-increasing speeds. 